Over the past few weeks, we here at the OU College of Dentistry have had to make numerous changes to the way in which we operate. Similar to your offices, we've had to reschedule all non-emergent care appointments, which has caused a decrease in our clinical revenue. As an educational institution, we've had to make changes that affect our educational support systems and are working to ensure our graduating students are able to complete their educational requirements as close to their graduation date as possible. I want to assure you that the college is taking COVID-19 epidemic very seriously as we continue to monitor and adjust our clinical operations as needed. The health of our patients, students, faculty, residents, and staff is of the utmost importance. I recognize that our dental community is hurting right now. We have all had to make difficult and costly decisions for the health and safety of our families, our patients, and our staff. I understand that if you're not able to make a gift to the J.D. Robertson Society this year, and I want to thank you for your generosities in the years past. However, if you are able to support the Society this year, I encourage you to do so. We need your support now more than ever. As you know, the J.D. Robertson Society provides necessary funds to supplement programs throughout the college and provides much needed indigent care that funds for the patients who would otherwise not be able to afford the cost of their dental care. Despite this pandemic, the college is committed to continuing these programs and providing high quality dental care at a low cost to our patients. Your gift will go to support student scholarships, student research, and various other programs already in progress. And your gift will help to ensure our fellow Oklahomans continue to receive affordable dental care. These are definitely challenging times for us all, but through the years, Oklahomans have proven themselves resilient and show great strength during difficult times. The college has weathered difficult years in the past and will continue to do so. Despite these setbacks and with the support of our alumni and friends, I'm certain that our future remains bright.